Uh, and here's an exclusive news break on that. Morgan Stanley, we understand, has launched a book to buy five crore shares of Tata Motors. That translates to roughly about 1.73% stake of the company. And this will be done at a 10% premium. The book has been launched at a maximum offer price of 499 rupees per share, so up to 499 rupees per share. Today, the Tata Motors stock shut shop at about 454 rupees. Morgan Stanley, we learn, is the sole book runner. Let's go across to Prashant. Now, Prashant, uh, we're not clear who the buyer is, but what do you make of this? Uh, you know, it's going to be interesting because ta in Tata Motors, uh, the Tata Group, the promoters, uh, Shireen, have about 39.6% voting rights. Uh, voting rights and in the in the case of Tata Motors it gets a little bit more complicated because you have the you have DVR which is differential voting rights and you also have ADR which of course trades in uh, New York uh, in the case of DVR uh, the way it's structured is that 10 shares have got one voting right I mean 10 shares have got one vote uh, so you know what you basically want to do is you want to adjust for the regular shares uh, all of which will have one sh one vote each uh, and you also want to adjust for the uh, DVR, uh, in, uh, you know, in, in whose case you have one vote per 10 shares. Uh, so that is one. Then you have ADRs as well. The way EGM shareholding and EGM voting actually works is that the company is obligated to send out a message uh, to all shareholders to come and vote on the resolution which has been moved before shareholders. They are not obligated to do, to do so in the case of ADR shareholders. Uh, so, uh, you know, but the ADR shareholders, if they so desire, can come forward and say, well, we would like to participate in this referendum or in this vote as well. And they'd have to send a letter to the promoter. We don't know if the ADR shareholders have done that. So in the case of Tata Motors, what we are essentially doing is taking out the shareholding uh, of, of, the, the, of the ADR shares and looking at uh, the promoter shareholding in Tata Motors and the DVR shares, which is which works out to about 39.6%. So the Tata Sun's shareholding is 39.6% in Tata Motors. That is the number I think that we want to kind of remember when we look at Tata Motors and the vote uh, at the shareholder meet when it actually does come up. Back to you. All right, Prashant, appreciate you joining us and thanks very much for uh, taking us through what this transaction could mean. So watch out for Tata Motors uh, tomorrow as we pointed out uh, Morgan Stanley, the sole book runner and the buyer so far undisclosed.